what is up youtube welcome welcome back to my channel i'm back with another video in today's video i'm going to be doing a nails and lashes haul now this is more of a lash haul because most of the items that i purchased are for lashes as i said in my last video i'm going to be starting lashes so all my investment will be towards lashes and of course some for nails so um i do have a few things for nails and then i have more stuff for lashes so before we get started, please like and subscribe, follow me on all social medias, the links will be down in the description below, and let's get straight to it. Alright, so the first item that I have here is this tripod, look how beautiful, um, so it sits up in the table, let's put it on this side right here. Alright, so this is my nail table, it's not positioned how I usually put it when my clients come in. Um, but let's say that this is the way that I usually have it. Like, let's imagine it. Um, if I record videos on my clients or anything of sort, it doesn't matter. It doesn't have to be for YouTube. It can be for TikTok or just regular videos. This is a great, um, tripod for nail text. Not only that, but for lash text. You can put this under the pillow that comes with the, um, lash bed oh my god you guys this is perfect i can't wait to start doing nails i'm gonna act like i'm falling look there's no movement at all and you can see literally everything when i did my last um my last videos i did nails and the angle was horrible like i was so stressed out but look at this this is perfect and then if i want to zoom let's say i'm showing you guys my nails if i want to zoom in this is perfect. I'm telling you guys, I'm telling you, if you do content for YouTube and for TikTok, it comes with this. Um, but if you're doing content for YouTube, look at this angle. It's just perfect. This is um, not a ring light, but a lamp or light, however you want to call it. And it's pretty um, big. Look, I can't even show you all of it because that's how big it is. Um, let's open it up. And as you can see, this is the light. Looks like LED. Um, it's um, a thing where you can move it, which I love. Um, just for um, extending the length which I'm going to do right now and show you guys. Okay, so this is what I, I was talking about. Um, as you can see, like I basically extended it longer, which is perfect because it's definitely gonna light up the whole table. And I just love this. $65, you guys. It's This is not nothing compared to a ring light. So I'm gonna put my hands so you guys can see the lighting. All right, so. This is on, it's still on, but it's on low. And here I'm slowly putting it up. Okay, the next thing that I got is a desktop vacuum cleaner or um, desk collector. This is a definitely a need because when you're falling, all that dust is coming everywhere into your nose, lungs. It's not safe, it's not healthy so definitely get one of these i think this is about 30 to 40 dollars on amazon you can take out the filter and there's the fan i'm not going to turn it on but um this is definitely recommended next thing that i got is for lashing um i'm gonna be showing you guys what it, what this is for Okay, this is a little tray that I'm going to attach to my light or lamp. Um, so when, cause like I said, I'm going to use the lamp for both nails and lashes. So this is perfect for putting all your items that you need to do lashes, tweezers, glue, um, lash shampoo, whatever it is that you need. This is perfect. So I'm going to show you a demonstration. All right, so this is the demonstration. Sorry for the cords, but you know I'm currently recording. Um, this is basically how it's gonna look like once I have my lash bed. Pretend there's a lash bed right here on this side, and then my cart over here. 
um this is where i'm gonna keep everything like i said nail glue lashes all right next is nothing too big um i forgot what this is called it's like a mister mister i don't know but it has no water so i can't currently show you how it works but i love it because it's pretty small um this is where you put the water and you did you need this um for best retention after your lashes you um sprint that or um on your client's lashes so yeah this is how you turn it on as you can see it has a blue light next you guys is what i've always wanted to purchase oh my god finally it's here about 30 dollars this is a hand rest i bought it in black because i feel like white is gonna get dirty easily um and also because pink i'm trying to get rid of pink colors i want more like black colors into this business that i'm doing um so i'm tired like i'm not tired of pink i'm gonna have certain stuff pink but just pink black and other colors feel me so this is how it's looking it's giving leather all right it is finally finally done this is what it's looking like on the bottom and then yep very comfortable i love it it's really comfortable i feel like it's gonna help for your client's back too um i feel like my hand is just resting it's hanging so it's gonna be perfect for me because my client's hand is going to be rest. Next thing that I got. This is a cordless rechargeable nail lamp. Now, this is the, you need this. You need this. Like, come on now. You don't want any type of cords going in the middle. Um, that is annoying. So, get a rechargeable one. This costs about... I don't know. I forgot. But $45, I believe. Or maybe less. Maybe more. I don't know. But it's definitely worth um, spending your money on this. I'm not saying you have to. Mind you, I started off with one that has a cord. Not only that, it was very, very cheap. One thing I will say is bye-bye to this lamp. Oh my god, it was so annoying. Um, and bye-bye to this dirty-looking, cheap lamp i'm sorry boo like you've been through it all with me but you need to go and voila to the new one. Oh my god yes okay finally because that thing was dirty um so it has an on button over here i don't know if you can see the letters i mean the numbers i said letters but we're gonna turn it on as you can see it is on Ooh already breaking stuff oh i like that this is magnet you guys this is magnet okay i love it all right but for real i want you to show you guys how this looks from the inside very bright um it's very very bright all right next thing i'm gonna show you guys four items all at once so oh, this is my lashes stuff. This is what I got new. I'm I haven't done a review. I don't know how these products work. Um, all I know is that this has been going around a lot on TikTok. So this is definitely for beginners. Like I said, I don't know how this works. I don't know like if it's good or not. So I'm not gonna give a review. I'm just gonna show you guys an opening. So this is the nail glue that I got. It's pretty small. I thought was, I thought it would be bigger. Um, it says extra st strong evolution and this is um stacy lash this is all stacy lash so it's all from the same brand which is good because when you buy things from the same brand it's better because um you're not using different brands and sometimes chemicals don't go together so this is like an opener has like a needle inside um which i'm not going to open because it's not being used yet I also got a container for the glue. I forgot what's it called, but it's so it lasts longer. Um, this is the lash shampoo. It came with a brush. It's very nice and cute. And then the lash shampoo. It says no rotation, no burning.
Next thing that I got is the Bonner or primer, whatever you want to call Oh no, this is the primer and this is the Bonder. I'm not sure when do you put this, if it's after or before, but um, it's definitely all for retention. Um, because I want to start lashes but as a beginner, but I don't want also that my clients come back and like, okay, you're new, but you're, my lashes are falling off feel me so this is why i'm trying my best to buy the best products or best reviewed but this is also not the best this is something affordable that can probably work for you mind you i still have i don't still don't know how this works but it's the most recommended so this is the lash primer um so obviously this is a solution that you apply probably before and then this one is the after or before and after but Moving on to the next. This is all from Amazon. And these are the lash trays. Um, I'm not sure if these are the best ones either. I just know that I'm gonna practice on these. I also bought a mannequin that is arriving tomorrow. It's actually not a mannequin, it's like a flat mannequin, but. Okay, so. And now I finally received the mannequin or flash mannequin. I don't know. I mean, it's it's a um, it's a flat mannequin which I like. I feel like how do I explain this? It's just better. Let me try and see. Oh, I got something right here. It's like isolation tweezers, but it's also a nail sequin grabber. The next thing that I got is 8080 grit um, files. I believe this is 25 of them. Very good to use on each client. Um, affordable and also I recommend the 8080 grit if you want that crispy square looking shape or even if it's coffin, but it gives that crispy look. Next thing that I got, so this is my practice hand. This is my regular practice hand. I love it. It's been through it all with me um, since I first began. This is the first thing that I bought um, when I started doing nails. So this is a tip that I'm giving to you. Get a practice hand. Don't do it on yourself. It's not the same. A practice hand really does. It is worth it. A lot of nail techs um, seem to be like, no, I'd rather do it on human. I feel like it's better. Blah, blah, blah. blah. I'm not bashing you. I used to be just like that. I used to think that it was better on a human and it is like it's different You're actually seeing the results if you're a beginner get a practice hand um, most of the nail techs when once they start doing nails and They see that they pro have progress They stop using the nail hand and then they be like no I'd rather use it on someone else a human because it's annoying, blah, 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 it's not the same, the cuticle doesn't look the same, you know, they always complain about that, and honestly, it is true, it is true, I complain about the same, but what the practice hand helps you is with the application, not the cuticle, the cuticle you will start learning with um, your clients, but the um, practice hand definitely helps you a lot with application that's why my application has been better ever since i started using my um practice hand more so yeah okay, the next thing that i got is i don't know what this is called um it says task brand wipes but these are more like mechanic wipes because um this they sell these only in AutoZone. I think they do sell them at Walmart or Target, but it's gonna be like in the car area or car item area. I don't know how to explain it, but um, the reason why is because they use it for oil. So you know, cars are very oily, and this really sucks in like oil or any type of liquid. Alright you guys, this is um, the rest of the stuff that I said I was going to receive, but instead of continuing with this video, I'm going to do a part two, but this one is going to be a Sheen Lash Haul. 
so i know you guys are probably like sheen like this probably has to be cheap um you can get this on amazon probably for four dollars or more while this is like one or two dollars in sheen seven dollars in amazon while this is one to two dollars a sheen four dollars fan And it has a little light. Rechargeable. Four dollars. And I will say this is very powerful. Very powerful. It's it it's not cheap. Like stop spending your money on Amazon stuff. This cost, I think this was like five dollars. I don't know how much this was. I think it was like about three, four dollars. This is like seven dollars on Amazon. These stuff, all these are seven dollars each. Everything here that, that you see on Amazon, seven dollars each. These are like ten for like two dollars. This costs like twenty-five on Amazon. I'm telling you guys, stop spending your money on Amazon, especially lash kits. You can buy everything separate on Sheen. So yeah, you guys, stay tuned if you want to see this Sheen haul. Thank you for watching, you guys. I hope you guys enjoy. I know this was a long video, but, but part two would definitely be worth it. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys on my next one.